Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to a brand new reaction of Mr. Robot. Today we got Season 1, Episode 6. Now before we get started, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Like usual, I'd really appreciate that. And also, Happy New Year's. I think this is the last Mr. Robot video that I'm going to be able to record in 2023. New Year's is a few days away. So, Happy New Year's. You might even be watching this in the new year. Yeah, 2024, here we go. Alright, so, Fernando... He's not happy with Elliot. Elliot did some stuff to Fernando. And now Sheila is in trouble too. So now Elliot has to rescue Sheila and stay away from Fernando. But also the Mr. Robot plan kind of went awry last episode. There's a lot of moving pieces here. But we're just getting started too. Like early days here. I'm excited. Let's go ahead and jump into episode 6 and see what the hell Mr. Robot has for us. Elliot Alderson. I'm flight. I am fear. I am anxiety, terror, panic. Yes, you are. Yes, you are, Elliot. But something's going to tell me that you're going to fight this. Because, well, Sheila is on the other side of this, right? That's your girl. Oh, she's here. She's, she's good. Doesn't feel she's real. She's free. I'm sorry. <laughs> Elliot, you going to stand up? Fight or flight? First time we met. Doesn't feel that long ago. If I could go back and undo you this. You can't. So what happened to her? Did her place just get trashed? Thumbs up. Okay. Oh, never mind. That's what happened. Ah, oh, I see. I see. This is their establishment. The origin of your name. I looked it up for you, bro. Where are you taking her? L <laughs> origin of your name. Why is this guy such a philosophical gangster? Savages? Are we brave? Don't know, bro. Listen to me, man. I didn't get angry. I got impressed. <laughs> ah, he's gonna recruit him to grow his business. That's smart. Crosshairs on my heart. I don't make it out. I'm dead. Do your thing, bro. You're asking the impossible. Well, I feel like this is gonna be possible for you, Elliot. She'll be there tonight, too. It'll be one big happy, happy. <laughs> Oh, this guy is terrible. I like it. He's chaos. I know you gotta hack him out of prison, I guess. That's not a like a direction that I thought this would go. Hacky computer hacker genius, my thick Dominican dick. <laughs> that was just word jumble. You violate that dictate, we kill your sweetheart. <laughs> your eyes are good. How my dictate? <laughs> All right, well, let's hope Elliot knows how to fight. Something about him bugs me. And you know what I like to do when that happens. Oh, dude, he's about to play some psychological warfare with them by knowing all their secrets. Hi, I'm trying to reach Mr. Beckett. Mm, she trying to sue on her mom's behalf? Those USB drives? What? Right next to the police station too? What's that about? You'll see that I have the evidence from the data dumps. Along with further research. Stickies. Oh, and you've highlighted and underlined. This woman does not look enthusiastic about this. So, you want to take internet gossip? Okay, well, <laughs> is Matt Murdock in the city? Can we get Matt Murdock on the phone? Raped his pregnant girlfriend, bashed her head in with an Xbox. Claimed she cheated during Halo. With an Xbox? I called every lawyer from this case, and you're the only one that called me back. That's a good point. Like, you were interested. Okay, so she dumped these flash drives next to a police station. They have to have data on them. Important information that the police can use about something. Don't plug it into a work computer, dude. What are you doing? This is a virus, dude. What are you doing? Unplug the thing! Connection closed by remote host. No. You think I give a shit about your goddamn floor? I don't know, you take the dog out then, damn. You hear what I said? I said you can take her. What are they about to do? I'm very excited to see how Elliot flips the table on them. Where the hell are you going? I have no problem telling these two douche tools they're gonna have to sit on their pricks so we can find a better solution. You don't under- uh, 
it hit me late that he kind of recruited her to help. That's what's up, girl. Hmm? That makes sense. The police station getting into the system. As much as I think this company is evil incarnate, and trust me, they are. Evil Corp. You know. Somebody in the last video pointed out that the scene where Elliot is in them, the evil, the E Corp logo is Evil Corp. And when he's not in them, it's E Corp. I'm going to be looking out for that. I didn't notice that yet. Thanks to the person that pointed that out. Someone who was there when the decision was made to falsify chemical waste intel. Mm, who do we know? Who do we know? Who do we know? We know somebody. You have a boyfriend? How's your dad? I work for a company that doesn't respect me. My boyfriend recently cheated on me. My father is drowning in debt. Life's good. Could be better, but life's good. When she said all that, it's like, damn, there is a lot going on in her life. But like, she's keeping a calm face. Good for her. Is that a Vacheron? Patek Philippe Tourbillon, a gift. For damn. I'm so poor, I had no idea they were talking about watches until he mentioned Padik. I, I, I lost it already. <laughs> I know you think you were a shoe in for CTO. So how about you cut the bullshit? I like it. Direct with him. Entire evening was enchanting the food, the wine, the lovely Sharon. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to get to him through his wife. Did you enjoy the view? Oh, <laughs> he knows. Do you think she wouldn't tell me? Watching the Knowles family urinate. Hell, I could fly my brother in from Miami. What an interesting conversation. Tyrell. I want you to accept the hard truth right here, right now, in front of me. The hard truth, and your zipper is out. I want to see that look wash over your face. He's just going to come at you harder. God damn it, just more penis jokes. Here. <laughs> That's so disrespectful to him. This would probably pay off the rest of your mortgage. <laughs> Neat little two-bedroom in Chelsea. Attacking his ego. There. That's a look I was looking for. <laughs> I like it. I like that he has an adversary. And this guy, this guy like knew how to press him, how to press Tyrell. Tyrell thought he knew how to press him, which he will find another way to. He'll go even harder at him. But that other guy, he knew how to counter it. Shit. Why is she here? No, nobody's home. Nobody's home. Elliot, He's not home. Shut her up and get her the hell out of here. Bro, no, you could just, you could have just outweighed her. Oh no, not the big ass vase! Who was a scene stealer last episode? Men, jag hade henne hon visade ju för fan benen för mig! Speak like not to Louise. What language are they speaking? I wanted to say, I think a couple episodes ago I said to myself it was French, but then I was like, it could be not French, it could be Swedish. Prøv nu lige at fatte kontrollen en gang, inden du mister den helt, ikke? Og i virkeligheden, så har hun jo lige gjort sin tjeneste, ikke? Hallo? Nu ved I, hvad der er, hun vil. Mm. She wants to get slammed! Hun vil begæres. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so Tyrell there was worried. Interesting. He showed fear. And his wife kind of reeled him back in. We were right about it all along. In fact, that... News report it wasn't a confirmation. It was a reminder. Listen, Angela, now's not. I have an idea that will change the world. Ooh, yeah. So does so does Elliot. I know how to do it. Yeah, can we talk about this in a few days? Not right now. Not right now. Evil Corp. Angela, Vera, his brother, Darlene, Shayla. This is too much. Yeah, it is too much. You'll do what's right. <sighs> Elliot. She is single now. How's Shayla, by the way? Super kidnapped. Just, just, just the most kidnapped. Tell her I say hi. That's a threat. She's like, yeah, I'm single now. Tell Shayla I said, hey, that's a threat from her. You have no time to pull off whatever it is you think you're doing. What are you doing? This motherfucker isn't real. He's not real. How, how does he just, how does he just appear out of thin air? She was dead the minute she started working with that maniac. Forget nope. it. It's nope. not happening. We're not sacrificing people. But assume for a second that you do pull this off. Boss Vera out of prison. Who's to say he doesn't kill you, Shayla, Darlene? It would be in his own best interest. That's a fair point. The best thing you can do for Shayla, allow her to become a memory. That's a cold line. 
allow her to become a memory. In this new world that we are so close to creating will never be. In that new world, that is success. F society is success. You win one battle at a time to win the war, right? Right? That, that sounded smart in my head, so. There's that sensation again, fight or flight. I, Elliot Alderson, am. He's fighting. What's up, man? You ain't got no Drake, no Pitbull, no nothing. Like, what's up? Don't look at that. That's not for you. Remember when the panic would set in and we had a solution? Be honest, I missed that. I oh, the drugs. Running an undetectable activated signal sniffer that will locate any kind of wireless signal in sight. Okay. James Bond type shit. You showed your face. And then I skip out tonight. Who do you think they're gonna finger? I'm opening every cell. <laughs> smart, smart. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! <laughs> now stop celebrating. What are you celebrating? Sit down. When you get out, I realize you're gonna have to split. You won't be able to stay in the tri-state area. Oh, I love this. <laughs> Means your whole operation still needs to be making you money. Come on, Elliot, give it to me. Yeah, he's gonna work for him. He had everything, your crew, shipments, the entire operation. I took it all. I own your whole world. Yes! Yes! Let's go! When this goes down, Shayla and I go free. Information is power. That's why I coded the leak to auto-send every 24 hours unless I continuously disable it. Jeez. That's like a chore every day. Every 24 hours, good luck. I gotta deactivate this thing. Remember. I'm gonna hug you. <laughs> That's a threat. But hey, that was smart by LA, yeah. No comment, do you understand? Oh, he doesn't remember her. He dissed, he dissed her last time. Get the hell away from my home. Get away from my home! He dissed her last time, and also he was, like, one of the people responsible for, you know, the whole thing going. I don't need to have WPA2 when there's dedicated 4G. It's crazy. It's crazy how the show is showing just, like, everything's connected. Like, all the Bluetooth and all that, it's all out there, dude. Come on, let's go. We don't have any time. Isaac's about to fuck this. Either Isaac's about to mess this up completely, or he has other uses for Elliot. Hack your whole operation. If you kill me, you don't you... get it. Like I said, it just wasn't your day. Really? Dead ass. Why? You don't though? want me to free Vera. I'm trying to kill him. That's why Vera wants to leave tonight. I try to kill his brother. You're the reason Vera's locked up right now, and he knows it. Vera was just gloating about how he got in with the right crew. How he got to jump on some men. Oh, he's not worried, man. He's protected now. That's not how that happened. None of that happened. But Elliot's playing that well. When I break Vera out tonight, you do with your brother what you want. Gosh, Elliot! I'm just playing my best move. The cojones on this dude. With a gun to his head. His pants gotta be a little soaked after that. Just a little soaked. <laughs> I love how they took the time to let him type all of that out. Can we go out and play and see dance? See where the night takes us. Yo, yo, yo. Her eyes. Eyes, eyes up here, buddy. Let's go to the meet, DJ. If I mistyped one command, hit one wrong key, the cell doors won't open. I don't make mistakes. Confidence. I like it. What you need your peace for, bro? Boy Wonder says Bro's he's opening all the cells. For his Some brother. Tries to rush us. I think Fernando is gonna kill his brother though. And he's gonna catch Isaac's uh, sleeping. Ooh, nice. By the way, uh, I noticed a couple episodes ago the soundtrack kinda sounds like soundtrack from GTA 5. GTA 5 during missions, especially the loading screen has this kind of this kind of music it's like just music where you sit and wait that's told 10 minute loading and you just like vibe to it <laughs> this shit tastes better than any pussy i ever had let's see are you getting shot everybody in the car let's go dj shoot the cocksucker oh <laughs> nice he knew isaac should have been quicker dude call you sleeping that's what the universe asked of me to be my brother's keeper, brave wanderer. Look how you help me. I feel like we should probably speed this up and go. 
Let's have the talk somewhere else. Dead proof. My operation is over. It's a go on. Crash it, burn it to the ground. Shit. I mean, yeah, you still gotta leave the tri-state area, buddy, right? Shayla. I told you you get her back, bro. She was with you the whole time. No way. She's been in the trunk this whole time. Has she been breathing? Oh, he's worried she might be dead in there. She dead? Whoa, what's going on? She, how is she? What's going on? No way she's dead. Really? I mean, pretty big twist if she's actually dead. Damn, I love how much time they spent on this. Just letting Rami Malik act. Elliot, let's go! Whoa, no way! Of course she had to die. She was just turning her life around. Of course we couldn't let her have her life. We, we needed to kill her. Okay, so I'm watching this on Amazon Prime right now, right? And I thought she was going to survive because the next episode, episode 7, I'm looking at the screen right now, you know, the Mr. Robot show is open. You know, I'm watching this by episode, so we just watched episode 6. Episode 7, there's a thumbnail for every episode. And Sh Sheila is the thumbnail for episode seven. So that's why I was like, she's probably, she's going to survive this episode. But now, is it going to be a flashback? Is that her? Or is that, am I confusing her with somebody else? Like, I know I shouldn't be looking at these thumbnails, but like, they're right there. When I launch every episode, they're right there. I'm sorry, guys. I can't just be like, oh, I have to block everything. And usually most of the time these thumbnails aren't spoilers but when she got kidnapped and then episode seven is right next to episode six and the thumbnail is like right there like what are you gonna do right oh dude they killed her it was a, some crazy mind games from everybody it was a crazy episode because it was like you know isaac had the upper hand on elliot and then elliot had the upper hand on fernando and isaac and then fernando had the upper hand on isaac and elliot just kind of everybody was you know, switching who has more power over who. And at the end of the day, I think Fernando won. I wonder if we'll see him again. Maybe not this season. Maybe he will come back a couple of seasons later. Right now, he said, you know, he's gone. You know, he's a fugitive. He doesn't need his business anymore. So whatever, you know, whatever blackmail Elliot had over him doesn't matter anymore. He's gone, but he has to leave new york city he has to leave the state right he has to go somewhere else so it's like he can't be here so maybe you know a couple of seasons down the road he'll come back in some way or maybe he's back next episode who knows you know they could have just ended this storyline with fernando going to jail the first time but they brought him back for a reason and they brought him back they didn't just bring him back to kill sheila right or maybe they did but I feel like he's still going to play a bigger part in all of this somehow. I don't think they put him in jail and then got him out of jail and killed Sheila. And that was like, that's it. That's Fernando right there. Maybe it is. I, I'm not really complaining if that's the way they chose to go with it. Um, but I'm left thinking right now that there is something more to it. The prison break was the biggest part of this episode. But there was another very interesting part of this episode was where Tyrell got challenged. And he looked scared. He looked like he uh, lost for a second there. And his wife kind of, uh, she reeled him back in. And now they might have, they might be hatching up another plan. Which has to do with targeting that other guy's wife. She wants that Tyrell penis. So, you know, go ahead. I'm starting to care more about the Angela storyline right now. Like this episode, she really got something important to do. And she's, or at least she's setting off on an important journey right now of like trying to get this, you know, this case made. So it seems like now she's being weaved into the story um, with more importance, I'd say. So I'm excited to see where that goes next. So yeah, that was my reaction to episode six of Mr. Robot. If you enjoyed today's reaction, make sure you leave a like and subscribe once again. Happy New Year. You might be watching this at the end of 2023 or you might be watching this in 2024. Just want to wish you all a happy new year. Check out some of my other videos and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.